Tu Wong Fu, thanks for everything. Julie Newmar, let's talk about it. This movie came out in 1995. I was in eighth grade. It was ahead of its time in 1995. And it took uh, popular audiences and critics by storm. Yes, there was a backlash from bigots, but all intents and purposes, that movie hit the mainstream media, hit mainstream audiences, and everyone loved it. Just need to take a moment as I'm re-watching it for the end time on Pride and I just because I need a comfort movie, really just give Swayze, Snipes, and Leguizamo their flowers for what they did that was so ahead of its time. Feels more ahead of its time in 2024 than it did in 1995 when I saw in the movie theater. And that is very fucking telling and very troubling and should um, worry us all. A uh, shout out to Wesley Snipes, who, remember, uh, was just off the heels like three years earlier from being a major action star. You had Demolition Man, you had uh, Rising Sun, and you also had New Jack City. Nino Brown is now Noxima. This is a black man in 1995 going from playing Nino Brown, one of the greatest performances ever, to Noxima. And then you have John Leguizamo, for all intents and purposes, very new on the scene, but a Latin actor coming in strong with a drag performance. I don't think Wesley Snipes nor Leguizamo get enough flowers for what they have contributed to cinema and pop culture. Patrick Swayze, career best in my opinion. Car Powder Blue, as an asterisk, might also be his career best and his last performance. You're Gen Z or Gen Alpha, or even if you're like an, a millennial with a Gen Z or Gen Alpha child, you need to be making them watch Tu Wong Fu need to be introducing them to Swayze's film catalog, to Snipes' film catalog, to Leguizamo's film catalog, and letting them know who the fuck Julie Newmar is because she's an icon. Start talking to your children about what came before them. Tuang Fu is just a, a, a heart-opening, mind-opening, and soul-opening film-going experience. Sharing this with your children. You need to be sharing this with the bigots in your life you need to be cracking people's hearts wide open with the gift that patrick swayze wesley snipes and john leguizamo gave us period